Hi, this is Tiyak. Welcome to my channel Technical Support Online. Today I show you how to delete your Microsoft tenant ID. So already you have used or unused tenant ID or you create the wrong tenant ID. So in this video I wanna go to show how to delete your Microsoft wrong or existing old tenant ID. So first I am going to Microsoft Azure portal portal.azure.com after entering azure.com now select azure active directory option now you can see here the company name and the microsoft tenant id and the primary domain account so i copy this uh, information and text into text folder so this is the wrong tenant id which i already created for customer so that's why I want to delete this wrong tenant ID. So this is the Microsoft uh, tenant ID which I want to delete. So now click manage account. After clicking manage account you can see here the Microsoft ID all the information. So select this and select delete option. After click the delete option you are going to the next page and you can see here the some information so now uh, the delete option is hide uh, delete your tenant uh, the company name and you can see here under the delete option is hide so click the directory properties blade and you, you are going to the next page and there is need to access for delete so i click yes and save this uh, page now the page is saved and uh, and the previous page when i refresh it and the delete button is come so now click the delete button now i again check the tenant and sure the tenant id is right so i click delete and the portal is successfully delete Now I am going to the admin portal and click refresh. After click refresh this page is not found. And going to the Azure Active Directory portal and sign out. After sign out I go to the portal azure.com again. And I am trying to log in here. So I am trying to log in this account and the username may be incorrect make sure your type of type is correctly otherwise contact your admin so this uh, username or the dom uh, custom domain id is deleted successfully from the portal.resi.com and the microsoft admin.microsoft.com so in this process you can delete your microsoft wrong tenant id or unused tenant id and the test purpose tenant id permanently so this is the permanently process you never uh, recover this tenant ID which you already deleted so be careful uh, when you uh, delete this tenant ID by this process so thanks for watching my video if you like this please subscribe share comments and hit the like button take care bye bye